Okay, so you follow the three C's from our resume writing tips and tricks episode, and you've gotten yourself a great resume. It's piqued the interest of a recruiter, and they've reached out to you for a phone interview. Now what? Stay tuned, because that's what we're covering today. What's up, everybody, and welcome to Reach Your Peak, Red Peak's very own information show, bringing you the tips and tricks you need to succeed, level up, and reach your peak. Today's topic is all about phone interview tips and tricks. You've made it to the next step of the hiring process, so you'll want to continue to make a great impression by following these three steps. No distractions, great service, and remembering to breathe. All too often, recruiters experience this. Hey there, is this Joe? Yep, this is he. Hey Joe, this hey from Red Peak. How are ya? I'm, I'm good. How are you? Still a good time to chat. Quiet. Yeah, yeah. One second. Just, just give me a second, okay? Oh, okay. So I've got your resume pulled up here in front of me. Paints me a great picture of your experiences. But I always like to like to ask everyone, you know, maybe tell me a little bit about yourself, where you're at in your career, maybe some things you're looking for. Yeah. So I start as a tech back in um 30 yeah you, you're we're trying to establish and kind of breaking up so then i told the guy that i wanted to to learn more on the job and figure some stuff out but at the same time he made joe you know trying to hold me back with some things and i want to ask really just more questions in bad my career so i'm trying to find a place yeah don't do that I can guarantee you that you could be the best possible candidate for a position, but if you come off as distracted, if they can't hear you clearly, or if you've been going on about the first question for about an hour and they can't ask you any further questions, you're just not setting yourself up for success to make it to the next round. So here's an example of how to properly handle a phone interview. Here we have our candidate, Brittany. She's found a place where she can be fully focused for this interview and have no distractions. She's even written some interview questions. Hi, this is Brittany. Yes, hi, it's so good to hear from you. I was expecting your call. Yeah, now's still a great time to chat. Oh, I can hear you just fine. Can you hear me? Perfect. She makes sure that the recruiter can hear her clearly. Fair. And I learned so much in the past that I can bring to the table. She answers each question fully and to the best of her ability while still allowing room for good conversation. Yes, I can absolutely meet for an in-person interview this week. Yeah, how does Thursday at 10 a.m. work for you and your team? Awesome. Perfect. Well, I look forward to meeting you in person. Yes, thank you so much for your time today. Have a great day. Bye-bye. These steps should help you be successful in making it to the next round, which is the in-person interview. We'll be covering those tips and tricks for you in our next episode. Thanks for tuning in to this episode of Reach Your Peak, Red Peak's very own information show, bringing you the tips and tricks you need to succeed, level up, and reach your peak. Tune in next time. Bye.